Operation profiles define the schedules that model hourly variations in occupancy, lighting power, miscellaneous equipment power, and thermostat set points. The schedules should be typical of the thermal block's occupancy type. In certain science laboratories of the buildings, research work will be conducted on Saturdays and Sundays as well. There is a default operation profile available for such types of activity, so let's create a custom operation profile for our specific case. Let's display the operation profiles dialog with the help of the top right icon of the energy model review palette. All the available operation profiles are displayed at the top part of the palette. We will create a new operation profile based on the existing office profile. Let's click this profile once to select it, and then click the New button to add a new profile. Make sure that the duplicate office operation profile is selected, and then enter a new custom name for the custom profile. Let's make sure that the occupancy data type is non-residential. We will enter 50 watts per capita for human heat gain. 20 liters per day per capita value for the service hot water load. And finally, 4 liters per day value for the humidity load. Currently, this profile is set so that the weekdays are from Monday till Friday. And Saturday and Sunday are the weekend days. Let's uncheck Saturday at the Weekend Recurrence dialog. This will result in a certain amount of uncovered hours at the bottom of the page. These hours will be distributed evenly between the working Saturdays and the non-working Saturdays. Let's add another weekdays entry to the list. And click the Recurrence option to open the corresponding date range dialog. Make sure that only Saturday is selected here. Display the date range dialog and select the In a Given Time Period option. Set the start date from June 1st until August 31st. Now only 936 uncovered hours remained. Let's add another Weekends entry to the list. And make sure that, again, only Saturday is selected in the Recurrence dialog. Finally, specify a given period for date range from the beginning of September until the end of May. Please note that there are no more uncovered hours left. Let's proceed and adjust the daily schedule for the new profile at the Daily Profile Editor dialog. We will define workdays from 7 a.m. until 6 p.m. The maximum internal temperature will be 24 degrees Celsius, and the minimum internal temperature will be 20 degrees Celsius. Let's select the remaining daily time interval after 6 p.m. with the help of the mouse, and adjust the maximum internal temperature to 22 degrees Celsius, and the minimal internal temperature to 18 degrees. Let's also select the remaining time interval before 7 a.m. and adjust the set values as before. Let's also adjust the internal heat gain values. We will leave the occupancy count unchanged, 5 square meters per capita. We will specify LED light for lighting and 0.5 watts per square meter of power. We will specify 8 watts per square meter internal heat gain value for the equipment. We can also adjust or specify these values for the rest of the daily time intervals as well, in the very same manner. Let's select weekends at the top of the dialog and perform similar adjustments. Now we will select the entire day. Adjust the maximum and minimum internal temperature values. And also, specify desired internal heat gain values as required. 
Now, our custom operational profile is ready to be used in the calculations. Let's select the Science Thermal Block entry from the list and select the newly created operational profile from the pop-up list. 